I would uh, encourage mindfulness of the body. That's uh, the, uh, it can't be uh, underestimated how important it is, how valuable it is, and how powerful it is. Uh, because that mindfulness of the body gives an, an, an anchor for attention and awareness. And you've, you've got a home to return to. Uh, and to learn how to be really comfortable in the body. And then so that there's attention to the body uh, and awareness, but then also you start to feel how our moods of the mind, the different trains of thought that start to begin, how they're experienced in the body. Just that, that immediate feeling of maybe apprehension that you isn't uh, uh, you f you feel a tightening in your in your body or a kind of an excitement at something new or some meeting somebody. Uh, there's a feeling in the in in the body. Um, there's a restlessness that we feel, or there's you know, uh, so that it it it's we we. We tighten up, or we move, and it's 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 expressed through the body. And so that if we become tuned in uh, through mindfulness and awareness of the body, then we start to. It becomes a a mirror that we can can see our our mind, our m mental states, our moods much more clearly. So that's, to me, that's one of the most important tools to use, whether one's a lay person or a monastic. 